Saddle stitching is a very popular publication binding method that really is an economical way to hold pages together. With saddle stitching, folded sheets are gathered together and then stapled or stitched through the fold line with wire, which resembles the process of stapling. And finally, the edges are trimmed. The part of the machine on which the folded pages are secured at the time they're stitched is called a saddle, hence the name saddle stitching. When you're looking at saddle stitching as an option for your publication, there are some things you'll need to take into consideration. The number of pages in your book needs to be divisible by four to avoid blank pages at the back. A finished A4 book, magazine, brochure or catalogue will actually be made up of A3 sheets of paper folded in half, which gives each sheet four printable A4 pages. When setting up your document, ensure that your inner margins are large enough so that your publication can be easily read and that you don't get text too close to the fold or it will be difficult to read. The minimum number of pages for saddle stitching is 24 and the maximum is 64. And once the page count of your publication goes beyond the limit of what the saddle stitch method can accommodate, we then recommend perfect binding. It's also worth noting that if you'd like to have a printed spine to your publication, then saddle stitching is not suitable. So to recap, saddle stitching is great for publications with smaller page counts, providing they're divisible by four and where you don't want a printed spine. If you need any further information, then please don't hesitate to get in touch by email, or you can also use the chat function here on the website. <laughs>